Michael. Um, it's Game Hard here, and in this clip, we are going to learn how to set a custom resolution on a monitor that may not support the higher resolution that you're trying to go to. So, uh, I'm gonna show you guys something really quick on my screen. Well, you guys may not be able to see it, but um, my monitor's current mo maximum resolution is. 1366 by 768 at 60 hertz or um refresh rate at 60 hertz and the resolution i'm running at right now is 1920 by 1080 at 60 hertz so as you can see my resolution is a lot higher than my maximum resolution and that's exactly what i want to show you how you do or how you do that right now so um basically what happens is you want to get a program called PowerStrip. Now PowerStrip you search it up on Google and it's the very first link. So let me do that for you right now. And let me open up uh Google Chrome first and I'll show you right now. Okay, Google Chrome has opened up and uh here I'm gonna search up power strip. I don't know why I was capitalized, but yeah, it's this N Tech Taiwan and then Utilities Power Strip. It's this one, and just download Power Strip right here. It's a free download, and there is a paid version of this, but I just get the download Power Strip. Just hit that button, it'll start downloading, and after that, um, it should install. And yeah, and then so you just want to then open this up, and then you'll and then you'll see like a, a icon, the notifications. So that's what you want to do. You want to right click on that, go to Display Profiles, Configure, and now you want to go to Advanced Timing Options, Custom Resolutions and you want to choose the resolution most of the time you want to choose um the uh, preset resolution or whatever you don't usually you don't want to set your own unless you ex know exactly what you're doing but uh say you want to set a 1080p resolution you choose the 1080p one for a monitor so 1920 by 1080 for an LCD display so right here, 1920 by 1080, or yeah, that's the one I use. So 1920 by 1080 at 60 hertz. Th make sure that the refresh rate is the same as your monitors. That way, that's one of the most important things. So after you do that, just hit Add New Resolution, and it's and you have to be running as administrator, by the way. But uh, I'm not going to go through all the steps again. But you just do this and make sure when you start it up, you run it as a, um administrator. And you wanna, then you want to add the resolution. It will tell you like it will be harmful to your PC or whatever. And it can be but if you, know what, if you don't know what you're doing. And if you mess up during these steps, I'm not responsible for your computer breaking. So this is doing at your own risk and you just click OK to that and and then it'll come up saying that you need to restart the computer uh, to add the resolution and then you do restart and you know, after the restart is, restart is done just um, go into screen resolution and this is a monitor I have right now and you know, it's still recommended at 30, 1366 by 768 but now you see there's a, another step up there by 1920 by 1080 and that's the one you want to choose so after you choose that just hit apply it'll take a minute for the resolution to change and after it's changed your monitor will become is going to be a 1080p display so you know that's all there is to it and once you're done just you know, just continue on with whatever you do and enjoy the larger screen space that you now have. And if you have any questions, 
just leave it in the comments below and subscribe and yeah so that's all there is that I really have to show you guys in this video hope you liked it and give it a thumbs up it really motivates me to keep going if you guys do you know dislikes uh, whatever you know my videos aren't really great so I'm not gonna take you know dislikes too seriously but you know a thumbs up would be great and yeah so hope I see you guys soon or you guys watch some of my other videos if you really want to and thanks that's all I really have to say okay